Great Polygon also has an advanced mode that's, a that's activated by holding down the space bar. First I'll create the first polygon. And I hold down the space bar and you'll see the last two points in the previous polygon are highlighted uh, in purple. Dark to light is the order, so we're going in counterclockwise order. So now you just need to select or create two more points to finish that polygon. Another thing you can do is take advantage of Extrude Edge with Snap to Face on to extrude a series of edges and create new polygons that follow the shape. So I'll go to Edge Mode. I'll select a few edges. i use Extrude. And then I'll just pull these out. And they follow the surface. So with those two tools you can quickly uh, create a mesh that follows the shape of another mesh.